Hello, welcome to the daily message for this Friday in the octave of Easter. The question that I want to pose today is this. How will other people recognize Jesus in us? Earlier this week, I talked about the story of Jesus' appearance to Mary Magdalene. And the point that I was trying to make there was that we should be able and ready to recognize Jesus in each and every person whom we meet. And then we talked about the story of the uh, disciples on the road to Emmaus and how they recognized Jesus in the breaking of the bread. And my point there was that we should come to recognize and appreciate all the more the presence of Jesus in the Eucharist. So what do we, what do you and I need to do to be recognized by others as having Jesus present in us? I think there's a hint to be found in the book called The Acts of the Apostles, which is uh, one of our readings for today and also is used uh, frequently throughout the season of Easter. In the Acts of the Apostles, there are two ways in particular in which the disciples are recognized by others as having Jesus in them. One is by the way that they welcomed people. The disciples would preach and then they would welcome people into the Christian community. And the second way in which uh, Jesus was made manifest in them and through them was in their healing. The story for this day in uh, at, at Mass talks about how there was a, a disabled man who was cured by the disciples and how then he accompanied them. And so we are called to do as the disciples did. We are called to be people who are welcoming and we are called to be healers. Uh, we are called to welcome people both into our community and we are called to welcome all people into our hearts. And we are also called to be healers. We are called to reach out to people who are hurting and who are suffering and to help make them whole whether it be in body, in mind, or in spirit. So these are the ways in which we can act so that others will look at us and say, oh, there's one of those Christians. There's one of those believers in Jesus. Others will recognize the risen Christ in us when we do as he did. Thank you again for watching and have a great Friday and a great weekend.